All right, so we got Drake has a dot, nothing else. He only had uh, that one, that one song. Kendrick fucking dropped three since the Euphoria. So we got um, Meet the Grams and Not Like Us. We already watched six one six. All right, Kendrick Lamar, Meet the Grams. <clears throat> Let's go. Remember Aub Aubrey Graham for anybody who don't know where Grams came from. Our Aub Aubrey Graham. That is Drake. Dear Adonis, I'm sorry that that man is your father, let me be honest. It takes a man to be a man, your dad is not responsive. I look at him and wish your grandpa would a wore a condom. I'm sorry that you gotta grow up and then stand behind them. Life is hard, I know. The challenges always go beat us home. Sometimes our parents make mistakes that affect us until we grown. And you're a good kid that need good leadership. Let me be your mentor, since your daddy don't teach you shit. Never let Oh, bro. Don't let Adonis hear it, bro. He might go to the goat, bro. Kendrick is the goat, bro. Drake. Don't let don't let him hear Kendrick's beautiful words, bro. You gonna lose your son, bro. Nah, it ain't that deep, bro. I don't think so. But I don't know. They they brought the damn kids into it, man. <laughs> but I think Drake started though with the Whitney shit, so that's his fault. Honestly, it's his fault. Let a man piss on your leg, son. Oh. Either you die right there. Or Ooh. I miss something? He said, man, piss on your leg, son. On your leg, son. Either your daddy don't teach you shit. Never let a man piss on your leg, son. Either you die right there or pop that man in the head, son. Never Nigga, what? Drake got pissed on, bro? Or fall in the escort business, that's bad religion Please remember, you could be a bitch even if you got bitches Never code switch, whether right or wrong You're a black man, even if it don't benefit your goals Do some push-ups, get some discipline Don't cut them corners like your daddy did Fuck what Ozempic did Don't pay to play with them Brazilians Get a gym membership Understand, no throwing rocks and hiding hands, that's law Don't be ashamed about who Bro, we just gonna skip over the part where he got pissed on, bro? What the fuck? I don't know how I've been able to avoid hearing that. Holy shit. You with, that's how he treats your moms. Don't have a kid to hide a kid to hide again, be sure. 5% will comprehend, but 95 is lost. Be proud of who you are. Your strength come from within. A lot of superstars, that's real. But your daddy ain't one of them. And you nothing like him. You'll carry yourself as king. Can't understand me right now. Just play this when you 18. Dear Sandra, your son got some habits, I hope you don't undermine them Especially with all the girls that's hurt inside this climate You a woman, so you know how it feels to be in alignment With emotions, hoping a man can see you and not be blinded Dear Dennis, you gave birth to a master manipulator Even using you to prove who he is is a huge favor I think you should ask for more paper, and more paper, and more, uh, more paper I'm blaming you for all his gambling addictions, psychopath intuition, the man that like to play victim. You raised a horrible fucking person, the nerve of you, Dennis. Sandra, sit down, what I'm about to say is heavy, now listen. <clears throat> this nigga is snapping, bro. He calling them by their governments too, bro. Your son's a sick man with sick thoughts. I think niggas like him should die. Him and Weinstein should get fucked up in a cell for the rest of their life. He hates black women, hypersexualize them with kinks of a nympho fetish. Grew facial hair because he understood being the beard just fit him better. He got sex offenders on Hovio that he keep on a monthly allowance. And a child should never be compromised and he keeping his child around him. And we gotta raise our daughters knowing there's predators like him lurking. Fuck a rap battle, he should die so all of these women can live with a purpose. What predators do he, does he have around him, bro? This nigga is basically fucking Diddy, bro. I would say he's modern day Diddy, but Diddy just got caught. So, like, he can't be modern day Diddy. Diddy's still here. Uh, could he be like. No, he's just Diddy too, bro. <laughs> like, honestly, he's just Diddy too, bro. Like, he was just, like, I guess a less trendy Diddy. I don't know. But Drake's getting exposed right now, man. Welcome if you're just joining, but. He's getting exposed. I've been in this industry 12 years. I'ma tell y'all one little secret. It's some weird shit going on, and some of these artists be here to police it. They be streamlining victims all inside of their home and calling them tender. Then leak videos, sell themselves to further push their agendas. To any woman that be playing this music, know that you're. Bro. I wanna know how he got this information, bro. Like, I know he's been in the game for a minute, so he probably seen some shit, but like, damn, bro. 
Playing your sister, or better yet, selling your niece to the weirdos, not the good ones. Cat Williams said, Give you the truth, so I'ma get mine. The embassy about to get ready too, it's only a matter of time. Hey, Lil' Bron, keep the family away. Hey, Curry, keep the family away. To anybody that embody the love for their kids, keep the family away. They looking at you too, if you standing by him. Keep the family away, I'm looking to shoot through any pervert that lives. Keep the family safe. Dear baby girl, I'm sorry. Hey, this one is insane. I can't lie. This one just seems like an exposure. Like, he's just like, you know what? Fuck Drake. I'm exposing the hell out of him. But he said, Dear baby girl. Dear baby girl, I'm sorry that your father not active inside your world. He don't. No. No way. Aubrey again? He ain't talking about another one, bro. Ain't no way. Don't commit to much, but it's music, yeah, that's for sure. He a narcissist, misogynist, living inside his songs. Try to destroy families rather than taking care of his own. Should be no. teaching you timetables or watching Frozen with you. Or at your 11th birthday, singing poems with you. Instead, 11, bro? There's no way. Drake! You cannot be a deadbeat twice, my brother. Bruh. There's no way. There's no way you're a deadbeat twice, bruh. Being Turks, paying for sex and popping perks, examples that you don't deserve. I want to tell you that you're loved, you're brave, you're kind. You got a gift to change the world and can change your father's mind. Cause our children is the future, but he lives inside confusion. Money's always been illusion, but that's the life he's used to. His father probably didn't claim him neither. History do repeats itself, sometimes it don't need a reason. But I would like to say it's not your fault that he's hiding another child. Give him grace, this the reason I made Mr. Morale. So so our babies like you can cope later Give you some confidence to go through something It's hope later I never want to hear you chasing man Cause it's felt behavior Sitting in the club with sugar daddies for validation You need to know that love is eternity And trumps all pain I tell you who your father is Just play this song when it rains Yes he's a Hey man, Kendra sent a good ass message though He dissing Drake like High key as fuck But like he, he, he's shitting on Drake right now bro but his message is positive as hell. It, it's positive. Very, very positive. It's a good message for younger ladies out there. It's a great message. Uh, I'm, I'm glad he's like he's trying to help him out. That's all. Drake, he's telling him Drake is sending you down a bad route. And he's just trying to steer you the, way, the right way. That's all. I think it's great. Carry on. The hit maker, songwriter, superstar, right? And the fucking dead beat that should never say more life. Meet the ground. Damn, I did not expect that shit, my boy. <laughs> I, I felt that in my soul, bro. I can't, that went for the chest, bro. Like, I, I felt that shit. Superstar, right? And the fucking dead beat that should never say more life. Meet the Grams. And the Grams are wild, bro. So I'm basically talking about Drake, his daddy, and then uh, the mom. Like, just, like, them them three. I don't really think he's, he's on about Adonis or even, the, like, the little girl. Or, or like, he's basically just mentioning who all, all of them are. I'm pretty sure that's what he's really trying to say. Like, all of them. But that's that's insane, bro. <laughs> if this is, like, if this is actual fat, factual, but, like, but why would Kendrick make it up? Like, he's not one to make this type of shit up. So, it gotta be real. I don't know how the information got found out, but obviously someone, uh, someone, is, someone knows Drake. <laughs> Really, really well to know that he has another kid. Why did he cover that one up? Who knows, bro? Like, he didn't even have to cover Donna up, bro. Why would it even matter? How would it affect anything? You just still go rap or do whatever, be a pop star. You still do all your shit. I don't understand. You had you had so much money. Like, they're, they were... I don't understand. It just makes no sense. But continue on, young Kendrick. Dear Harbor, I know you probably thinking I wanted to crash your party. But truthfully, I don't have a hating bone in my body. It's supposed to be a good exhibition within the game. But you fucked up the moment you called out my family's name. Why you had to stoop so low to discredit some decent people? Guess integrity is lost when the metaphors doesn't reach you. And I like to understand, cause your house was never a home. 37, but you showing up as a seven year old. You got gambling problems, drinking problems, pill popping and spending problems. Bad with money, horror house, soliciting women problems. Therapies are lovely. Start, but I suggest some ayahuasca. Strip the ego from the bottom. 
I try to help but Damn, bro, he like going for the soul, like, and it's so like, it just feels like he's really trying to communicate with them. It doesn't even sound like he's like, he's like dissing him, but he's like calling out all his sins pretty much. That's what it seems like he's doing. He's like calling out all of Aubrey's sins and like put it on the surface. That's what I'm seeing. That's, that's what I'm seeing big time. He's calling them all out. Dies with you, cause I know that you ain't been through nothing. Crave entitlement, but wanna be like so bad that it's puzzling. No dominance, let's recap moments when you didn't fit in. No secret handshakes with your friend, no culture cachet to binge. Just disrespecting your mother, identities on the fence. Don't know which family will love you. The skin that you living in is compromised, and personas can't channel your masculine. Even when standing next to a woman, you a body shamer. Yeah, you go hide them baby mamas, ain't you? You embarrassed of them. Ah. That's not right, that ain't how mama raised us. Take that mask off. I want to see what's under them achievements. Why well, believe you? You never gave us nothing to believe in. Cause you lied about religious views. You lied about your surgery. You lied about your accent and your past tense. All is perjury. You lied about your ghost riders. You lied about your crew members. They all pussy. Oh, I, you lied you them. I know they all got you in them. You lied about your son. You lied about your daughter. Huh? You lied about them other kids. Boy, that shit made me feel like Randy Orton, bro. Oh, fuck. Oh, I hear voices in my head, boy. What the fuck? That shit is cool. Oh, dude, let me get a rerun, bruh. Masculine, even when standing next to a woman, you a body shamer. You go hide them baby mamas, ain't you? You embarrassed of them. That's not right. That ain't how mama raised us. Take that mask off. I wanna see what's under them achievements. Why well, believe you? You never gave us nothing to believe in. Cause you lied about religious views. You lied about your surgery. You lied about your accent and your past tense. All is perjury. You lied about your ghost riders. You lied about your crew members. They all pussy. You lied on them. I know they all got you in them. You lied about your son. You lied you lied about your daughter, huh? You lied about them other kids that's out there hoping that you come. You lied about the only artist that can offer you some help. Fuck a rap battle. This a long life battle with yourself. Hey, bro. Oh, my God. Nah, I ain't listening to that. But that nigga killed it, bro. <laughs> bro, he killed that shit. Especially with the fucking Randy Orton voice and shit, bro. That shit was so dope. I can't even lie, that was so dope.